Alison and I go through your questions and suggestions and you just talking crafty on the phone here. All right, so um, that's usually how it works, but today is a bit of a special episode. We've got a bit of a reveal of the Tonic Craft Kit. It's mm. like a reveal. The kit that everyone's talking about. So, dun, um, dun, so you know, a lot of you have, you know, almost, well, over half of, of what we could have is gone already. Um, and people are you know, just starting to see what's you know what's going to be yeah. part of it. And, and our aim with it for you, you know is to delight you and and you, you're going to really enjoy it. And we're going to show you today some of the bits which are in there, which are exclusive. You're not going to find anywhere else after this kit is gone. You're not going to find it anywhere else. So yeah, Alison, uh, take us away and show off this beautiful card. Well, we I know go. some of you have guessed what's in there. So this is the card. Whoops, that's oh, yeah. a work. It's so oh, really? good. <laughs> I know. You're, you're, it's it's for me and Owen. It's just a surprise to see the card <laughs> comes down because you just you work on it all day and then it's just like come down. And it's That's just the full thing. It's so good. The, the colours so probably good. doesn't do it justice on the cameras either. No, it's yeah. it's nice watercolour. Sort of yeah. there. and it's all shiny and it's like just so nice. It's yeah. so good. I've used loads of Nuvo today. Yeah. So that may be a hint. It may not. Mm. But the dye that you get in is the wreath dye here and the leaves. Yep, so we can oh, show the other dye. Show, yeah. show the dye set. Yeah, so, you could do that. so there's the dye set. So as always, it's a verse. Let me take all these bits off first and then I can show you exactly. As always, it's a verse or dye set. So we have an inner and an outer. And you have the middle bit that will stay in your cardstock. So the outer frame will cut it out of your cardstock and then the inner one then will cut um, an aperture for you. So you've got lots of bits and bobs to do with it. Then we also have a large leaf which plays an integral part to the stamps. We have two small leaves that you can decorate with. So we've got a nice Looks like a little, I don't know if it's a sycamore or maple. Not very good on leaves. <laughs> and let then we've know. got <laughs> in the comments. Yeah, let us know. <laughs> and then we've got a little sprig then that could be anything. You know, if you've got floras, whether you've got leaves, anything, these will go with them. So that's those. And we've also got this funny little looking die. <laughs> and you may be thinking, what on earth is that? <laughs> but, yeah. but when combined, dun, dun, dun. when you see these, hang on, let me go there the right are, way, are. you realise what they go with. Dun, dun. So the little hat is a stamp and you have a die, let me put it the right way, that matches perfectly. And it is actually, there's a tiny, tiny edge on it. But I will show you how to stamp that. And we have a large leaf that covers the leaf. Oh, I'm there trying to do it without a flare. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, on the hedgehog's tummy. So you can put your sentiments onto that leaf. You've also got the vein in for the leaf. And the sentiments you've got, I'm going to have to turn it around because I forget. <laughs> it's your big day, birthday wishes, it's celebration time, and we're sorry to hear your leaf in. Wah, wah, wah. wah, wah. <laughs> you, don't, you, you don't get the wah, wah, die either. No, no, no. no. <laughs> so we should have done a stamp for that. Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> so they are the stamps you're getting. These are photopolymer stamps, and they are beautiful quality. Um, Sylvia's with us. Hi, sorry, I missed the start. Is this from the kit? Yes. yes. From the kit. Um, this is our kit, Sylvia. So these are the exclusive die and stamp set that, that you get with them. So there's your um, your your die. You can watch it all back and see how it goes with everyone individually. Yep. And then you can see the stamps uh, here, which I just showed. So you would have just seen those there. So, are we any other questions? <laughs> yeah, um, we've got <laughs> just loads of people with us for, for a start. Yeah, yeah. So oh, Catherine's with us, Lois, uh, the other Alison, uh, say Alison's uh, Evans is with us too, Jen Cray's with us, Jean, uh, Michelle, Sue, th that's adorable. I hope the leaf stamp matched up with the dies. Yeah, yes. it does. Our design it does. Team, it does. They think of that kind of stuff. Uh, Victoria says, Afternoon, guys. Gorgeous goodies. Beautiful card, Ali. Hello to you all from Jane Wood. Deborah's with us. Um, Sylvia says we keep freezing and we're hoping uh, so the internet will, will stay with us today and be all right. Uh, Clonamon says hi, sorry we're late. And a few guys saying that you know they, they, they didn't get a notification. We'll check. If you go on the, the Facebook page, you can click 
notifications at the top where it yep. says following or liked, maybe that isn't ticked. If it isn't ticked, tick it and, and you'll always get a notification about us being live. Mm -hmm. But loads, um, loads of people who've ordered your kit already, we've packed something a little sort of surprise um, to for you really today. So um, might be something coming to you. Uh, like <laughs> <laughs> uh, The king of spoilers, yet again, <laughs> is, uh, yeah, but, revealed um, himself. But uh, yeah, definitely worth looking forward to, guys. Um, yeah, hopefully you're all enjoying. But I've seen loads of you just going through the names and um, all of all you regulars Hello and, and everyone. You, you, you're yes. gonna love it. Hello, ladies. And boys, if there's any there. Yes, yeah, definitely. So maybe you're just a bit shy. You come in to tell yeah. us that you're there. Come and tell, yeah, come on. Come in, if you if you're come watching, say us. first time watching, say hey, say uh, say, uh, say what you do, say we'll where you're from. We'll get you a biscuit. Sit you down in the front. Yeah, we'll get, uh, exactly. yeah, yeah, so we'll get you a pink wafer and you can sit down in the front door. <laughs> or a ball, then you can have whatever you have. Oh no, I'd rather not have a ball, then. No, I don't do that. Custard cream? I'll have a chocolate hobnob. A chocolate hobnob? <laughs> <laughs> or even any chocolate biscuit will do, as long as it's got chocolate on it. Just a chocolate bar. Yeah, that's right. That'll do a as well. Chocolate bar, yeah. Well, I wasn't sure how much time I'd have, so I've kind of cut a few bits ready. So, I did a background, and I'll do a quick background just to show you how I've got to this point. Um, yeah. So, it's, it's done with inking. And they're not tonic inks, I will admit that. Dare I say it? <gasps> Slanderous. Man. I know, uh, how dare How did they get in the building? How did anybody let <laughs> those in? <laughs> Smuggled uh, on your uh, person. On yeah. my person. <laughs> the colours I have used, and each background is different. You're never going to get two backgrounds the same. I think, it's be, I suppose the nature of making those backgrounds is just quite mad they're anyway. going to be <laughs> so yeah. it's hard to get the exact same one because you're literally exactly. just dotting stuff around exactly. so it's going to be i don't make it hard so if you're a bit frightened about doing things like this don't be if you've got inks in the house get them out hmm. and you really can do something like this because i'm not making it hard and i'll show you that now so i've got a couple of brushes and i'm going to start with my lightest color so this is scattered straw um, Sharon asks, please share on what size card stock you're using today. Right, the card, this card is a 7x7 seven seven card. Oops, if I bring Wait, it sorry, there. That's it. The, the base card is 7x7. Seven seven. So the, the one I'm inking now is a 6 inch square. So we kind of look in at 15 centimetres. Um, I don't know what 7 inches is in centimetres. Uh, 6 is 15 centimetres, so. How much is an inch? 17 and a half 17 then, and a half, there you there go. There we are, that'll do it. So that's a little bit of scattered straw. I've got a bit of rusty hinge. Um, I think I've forgotten to bring my red. As the Tim Holtz, because we work closely with Tim. Well, exactly. <laughs> I'll, we'll allow it. You're we'll allowed. allow it, we'll allow it. <laughs> so I'm just putting little bits of ink. As I say, there's no technique to this, believe you me because I'm not a colourist. I can have a little dabble, I'm not saying, but I'm not a colourist. Fiona says, uh, great having a hedgehog kit, especially after having the hero of the hedgehog as a mascot in the, in the World Championships. There it was you go. Well, I, you know when there's, there's a bit of planning and forethought Yeah, down? I think yeah. there is. It's, it's, it was awesome, the, the World Championships were, were brilliant. Did you watch? No, did you watch any of it? Oh, I they don't were, do they, sport. Were, they were great, it was. Uh, I'm sorry. It was some you know, good stories uh, throughout it. Uh, so. Uh, Valerie's asking, can't wait to get my first kit, when can I expect delivery? Uh, we're planning on sending out uh, for the same of every month then as well, roughly around the thir first of the month. Uh, so you should expect it a few days after that basically. There yeah. Um, so that's it, if, if, you're in the, if you're in the US or you, you've ordered from, yes. from Europe, then we'll try and get it out a little bit earlier, but um, it'll probably be a, you know, a little bit longer, but we'll try and get it to you as soon as we can. Yeah. So I'll give you all the colours I've used now. I've got a little bit of distressing. And I've got a little bit of um, Distress Oxides, which I've used all exactly the same. As you can tell, I'm not, I'm not fussy. And I, I know there's lots of techniques out there for using the Distress Oxides. Mm -hmm. But I just wanted a bit of colour on the background and I wanted a darker brown around the edge. So I've used Scattered Straw, Rusty Hinge, Vintage Photo, in distress inks and fossilized amber and fired brick in distress oxides. If I can get the words out. <laughs> the nice names <laughs> of them. <laughs> Quite nice names. So that's all I'm going to do now is take one of our spritzers and a little bit of spritzing over the top. 
and then dry it off. That's oh, sorry. Foot's asking. Um, <laughs> sorry. I, I knew I was doing it. Is the camera's so gone? It's all right. Sorry, cam's gone. Come to the rescue. Sorry, I'll answer a question sorry. while you're waiting. Um, Sue says, will we get a preview of what's in the kit every month? Yes, you will. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll make sure you do that. You know, th this month, because it's the first one, we've uh, been just trying to get sorry, everything yeah. ready and, and, and put it all together. But yeah, you'll have a preview every month and we'll let you know what you're going to be getting in the kit. and all the inspiration that's going to be going along with it. So we're going to have tutorials from your, your favorite presenters and design team um, doing some step-by-step -step tutorials to go along with that. You know, one from Alison, you have one from Karen as well, and, and a few others uh, who you're going I'll to enjoy. <laughs> and that'll all be on one page as well. That'll all be on one page. So you'll be able to just go on that page, just click down to the videos and, and watch them all. And uh, yeah, um, pretty much the plan is as soon as we send it out to you, you'll get an email with uh, where to find out all this information as well. Um, so you'll get a link to you with all. I think it's going to be a fair few videos, um, so it's going to be plenty of inspiration and what to do as well. It's lots of imagery and everything else as well. So yeah. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm glad everyone's everyone here looking forward to it and enjoying it. Um, Kim says, "What's the difference in ink and oxide?" You'll have question. to ask someone else that, I'm <laughs> afraid, ask Tim, message because Tim I don't yeah. know enough about them. Yeah, Tim will know. He loads on YouTube. Uh, Naomi says, wow, that card's stunning. Sue Stone, uh, Julie's in, hiya gang. Uh, Lion Team's with us again. Hey, Lion Team. Um, Karen, all of mine can't wake, <laughs> and I love pink wafers. <laughs> you, know, uh, you can have my pink wafer. <laughs> yeah. uh, Naomi from uh, Chicago, USA. Oh, there you go. a good time over there. Uh, lovely card, uh, Alison. Really autumnal. Yeah. yeah, and that, that's the theme of the kit. That's it. it. Yeah. So, yeah, an autumnal That's where we're theme. going. From so Tenerife, uh, Marion as well. Uh, sorry, just before. Can you, um, sorry, what's the difference between the distress and Same person, yeah, oh, there you go. Clone someone else, someone else I know. There you go as well. I gotta yeah. be honest, I then, don't oh, know sorry, enough uh, about them. Naomi's asked this, uh, well, uh, answered, sorry. Uh, oxides are a dye and a pigment mix, the others are just a dye ink. The oxides give a chalky, opaque finish. That was what I was going to say. Oh. They are a, a mortal. So, so mortal close. Oh. Is that right? That's fine. They're all part of the team, though. We're all part of the tonic team helping exactly. each other. So, yeah, yeah thanks, yeah. Naomi, for something up for us. So, there's the background I've done at the moment. I'm hiding behind the greenery here. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry so much about the middle because I'm going to be cutting that out. And there's the one I did earlier. So they're very, very similar. One is a little bit more browner, I would say, and a little bit less yellow. But you choose, you know, you put more. Really cool effect. I'm going to move those out the way. And now I'm going to do a little bit of die cutting. Uh, Gene wants in the kit, no. Papers and things to be for subscribers. There's going to be a, a free gift, a special free gift. Everyone's going to get there's a, a free gift in for everyone, but there's going to be an extra special f uh, free gift for subscribers, which we've been sorting out uh, this week. So you know, if you're a real tonicaholic and you like tonic, you're gonna you're gonna love this. You're gonna have a pride. You are gonna place. love it no uh, matter what. Yeah. <laughs> so um, yeah, that, that's what's uh, what's in the kit. But we'll show you exactly. You know, as as, as time progresses. And, and they we'll all come. In case you have noticed, there's a little. Um, Oh, sorry, I'm going to tangled up in this moment. <laughs> There's a little pack on the desk, and this is what your kit is going to arrive yeah. in. So it's got punch tools for storage. It's got little pockets where you can keep everything in. So um, that's where the die and the stamp set's going to hide in, so then you can always keep them, the exclusive ones. You can always keep them then, they're nice and safe. Exactly. Yeah. So I'm just going to... Yeah, sorry, a slight bit of freezing then. Hopefully, I fixed it. Yeah, oh. yeah that's what I'm, I'm just uh, I'm checking. I think we're are we back. Yeah, I think we're back now. We're fine. I'm going to do a little bit of an angle with this one. You know me, I, I'm not very good at quirky angles. I like everything symmetrical. <laughs> so, this one had the leaves in the corners. So, this one, I'm going to put the leaves at 3 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 9 o'clock, and 12 o'clock. Just to show that even though you're using exactly the same stuff, it can be a little bit different. When you see all the videos as well for, for the ones the girls are doing, mix and match. Fix that you like from one card and to another card and change your designs that way. Yeah, combine your other tonic products that you've got and put them together and create something, you know, something brand new. Use one part of the die. You know, these are dies and stamps you're going to be able to use just going forward you know you can make them a green you know if you want them to be a bit exactly. more, more of a summer a summer theme oh gosh yeah they can be summer easily um so uh, jill lee on uh, youtube hi everyone i was just going to ask about the monthly kit it's the first time i've joined in live can i have a wave oh, please jill. oh jill, hey, jill. 
There you go. We love to see whether you're a newbie, an oldie, yeah, or anything. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, definitely. It's great to see. Uh, you can join us, Jill. That's definitely. Take uh, well and truly Mary down. Craig saying, where do I order the kit, please, from sunny Spain? You go to uh, toniccraftkit.co.uk. Um, you can order it from there. We've opened up postage to the majority of European countries now. Uh, Spain is included in that there as well. So wow. If you are in a European country which isn't on the list or you haven't seen uh, you haven't seen anyone purchase from and you're not sure whether, drop us an email at support at and we can yep. add you to that list then. We can find we out. We can try and find Work a out the postage and, yeah. and sort because that's what we have to do. We kind of just work out how much it's going to cost, how long it's going to take to get you to make sure you've got it you know, when yep. everyone else does too. Lovely. Okay, now you're putting your centerpiece in. I only cut one die at a time so they don't overlap and they don't cross over then and you don't get any damage to your dies. So when I'm looking at it, there's one little die. Oh, sorry. Um, that's got a serrated edge on the top here. Okay, and that's the one I line up first. And that one goes with, I don't know what, what the name of it is, so I can't tell it. But you'll see the two serrated edges match together. Let me stick this down and then I'm going to get rid of the outer die then. So if you look there. Oh, you make me work today. I'm actually. sorry, Dan. I'm <laughs> so sorry. <laughs> there we are. The two serrated edges match. And if they are matching, then everything else is right. And everything in the world is hunky dory. That's the way we look at it. <laughs> Don't mention that brand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Other brands yeah. just drop in brands all over. Yeah. Oh, we, we like hunky dory too. They're all right. <laughs> we uh, like lots yeah. of we, we, we like, there's no, like, in the craft industry, I don't think it's not like that really. Like, we, no. when, when we went up to craft, uh, Crafts You Love the other day, you, yeah. you meet in, was you like know, last week? yeah, yeah, uh, last week. Was it week. last week? I think it was. Wow. And we just, you know, like, demos from, demonstrates from all different, you know, like Sizzix, KG Skilton was there, um, like, a few other. <laughs> Oh, I and am. They were all so nice. As it, as it goes. As it goes. No, it's fine. <gasps> Gilding flakes. I've contained. just dropped my box of gilding flakes the on the floor. Box contained. Oh, God. Dan will never there let me go. in again. We just cleaned it. <laughs> I'm causing <laughs> havoc today. I am so sorry, everyone. Uh. Oh, dear. Do you think yeah. I better go home? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we joked with Alison when she came and going, I'll oh, try and keep it tight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, like just that she goes, I'll give you a slap now. And then I just thought, <laughs> you would have been doing that. Yeah. You want to see the cleaning these boys have done this week? Yeah. Awesome. Oh, man, so, uh, sorry. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hang on, hang on. Didn't we just really do so many things. <laughs> so there's a. Uh, I've only just picked up all your mess off the floor. <laughs> I you know, I'm sorry. <laughs> there we are, that's better. There you go. For you to see it. Yeah. So the wreath is gorgeous. There's quite a lot of detail in the just like there's like quite really thin lines, so it's yeah. kind of like you can expect the It shoulders. reminds me of you know the willow weaving, um what's the other one? The cane. That's yeah, what it yeah. reminds me of. You don't really see the leaves until you put the outer edge on. So if I was going to put the outer edge on here, again, my point of reference is these wavy lines because I find them easier to navigate around. Um, some people are thinking that there was a big mess. Thankfully, no, there's not. Thankfully, there's not. there wasn't. Um, so you there is there is no in. mess to see, I'm afraid. But yeah, thankfully, there wasn't any. <laughs> so that would be the die if I was going to cut the whole thing out. There you go, you can put, he's on the account. Yeah. I'm, on, I'm on it now. Sorry, I'm on it. darling. <laughs> oh, I know. I feel uh, like a real diva yeah. now. I'm so sorry. Camera one, camera, camera two, two. And, Come on. and pirouette yeah. and four. <laughs> so that would be how I would cut it. Yeah. And what I would get is that. Sweet. So I had to cut some of the bits out of the demo and I'd be here all night. Yeah. Well, um, Cheryl just asked, actually, I said, the love of the wreath, can you cut the whole wreath out? Which, there I you go. I have done. There we are. I've preempted your question. Yeah. So, there's my wreath. So, I'm just going to stick these layers together. And I've, I've kind of kept it pretty flat. Although I did have... Hmm, I thought I did, anyway. Uh, um, oh yeah, how many dies are in the set, please? So you there are three, one, two, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, seven, seven dies, dies. In, the, in the autumnal leaves. And yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven stamps. Yeah. Uh, so that's 14 exclusive products.
kit that you're going to have and no one else will have. Only people who have the kit uh, will have that. Um, Samantha says, could you uh, could you use that die for could you use that die for Christmas and place red berries on the noodle drop? You All could. Possibilities, definitely. You could. Yeah, I, I like what you said then, but the wicker. I can see it like now, you know, like that wicker. Yeah. Wrapping. You know, sure you and wicker. I mean, you see white wicker as well, which looks stunning. So you could just cut this in white, do a black and white background. That would be amazing. So yeah, create some layer and depth, get your sticky pads out. And Oh, apologies for the noise. <laughs> We've got a yeah, the door's <laughs> open because wine was hot apparently. So, uh, <laughs> the fan in. Oh, and then we couldn't bring that fan in because there was gilding flakes in here. But then that could have gone horribly wrong either way. Anyway, so it uh, certainly could have. Oh, and your sound is gone. Oh, have I trod on it? Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> anything to upstage, you know. Oh. Can't take you oh, anywhere. <laughs> Sarah. This is such a catastrophe <laughs> today. I Sarah's am so sorry. Sarah's on the ball. She, you know, that, she that's what you, you guys know when it's about to the, say. The, the, <laughs> the frequent viewers know if anything goes wrong, we are we oblivious don't to know it. About yeah. it you, done it. I did. I thought I'd put some um, 3D foam pads in, but I haven't. Oh, da, 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 oh have you da, got some? <gasps> wow. I Look know. at this, guys. That's what happens when you clean up. Wow. <laughs> it doesn't happen at home with me or anything like that. Oh, you, no, no, no. you do find stuff when you clean, mind you know. But I lose stuff when I clean. Yeah. Because <laughs> I don't know where I've shoved it. That's why we only we did the craft too, because we're quite proud uh, of it. Tra Tracy's giving you a new nickname is Ali the Destroyer. <laughs> I am so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bit like one of those days, isn't it? Uh, <laughs> so there's our card. Sorry, Dan. That's uh, all right. I, I, it's fine now. There's a card. Come to expect it now. <laughs> 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 oh, but once I put the darker overlay on, it will pop it more. So I'm going to put this on some 3D foam just to make it um, just come to life a little bit. Mm. So if you haven't got, you know, you haven't bought 3D uh, foam pads before, yeah, have a play with them. You know, you, you can cut them up smaller sizes. Exactly. Like He's coming. <laughs> that could be right around you. That is. Yes. <laughs> well, Alison. Are we ready to go? I think so. Anyone who's missed out. So if you you went away and you're watching this back and you thought they're not coming back, well, they've they've, they've abandoned back. you. Well, it's not. We, we haven't abandoned. You couldn't you. get rid of us that easy. So we're back and we're going to be showing you the second part of this beautiful card. So maybe it's the first time you join us. Maybe you've only just seen us go live. Um, don't worry, Dan. I'll cover it. Come down. We're doing it. We're doing it. There, we <laughs> there we go. So you can see this awesomely cute, a nice shine on the leaf as well, doesn't it? I well, know. I'm going to come. show you. That's the come. Right, Rashmi has uh, confirmed that we are back. So oh, thanks, thanks Rashmi. Thanks, you Rashmi. waited around for us as well. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'll do a quick reprise, so to speak. Yes. I created a background. This was the background, and I used some distress oxides and some distress inks all together so a little bit of a mixture sprayed on some water with a spritzer into that then you've, if you've not if you've only just joined us then you've missed this fantastic die set go down below and then we'll have a look and you're gonna see yeah you can yes. see it quickly again as well yes. are they separate streams uh, no they're not the same video i think so will it just oh well you'll be fine in? i don't know let's see let's see <laughs> <laughs> hello you back hey big so I cut into the, the card that I spritzed, then I stuck sticky pads on. I'm having a disastrous day, I am so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I cut in the, um, the shape die, then I used the inner die to cut the aperture. Then I used the three dies then, not together I hasten to add, to cut a brown wreath. So that was our wreath all cut in brown. So I'm going to overlay this now 
over the other wreath and it matches pretty easily because if you look at hang on make sure you've got the right leaves and you look in the right way and I've popped this onto some 3d foam pads so we've got a little bit of depth going on so there we are there's our our wreath on board yeah. and nice little bit of depth okay, okay next part so our next bit then is to stamp no i'll tell you what i'll do next i'll do the hat next i just want to double check is it, is it smooth for everyone or are you is it stopping and starting because they are not <laughs> my my comments i just want to check because because what we can do is if the stream isn't good for everyone we can record it and then upload the second half so you get it smooth as you like and then and then we'll put the two together and you'll get one long thing so on let my end it seems okay it's on yours, yeah? Yeah. Smooth. Okay. Well, well not, on, not on my phone. But not on my phone does, either. But, it's, but we are on 3G though, so that might be a reason. Why. That might be the reason. Yeah, you've not frozen once for me, sound, etc. Okay. okay. Jen, we got your word, Jen, okay? Yeah, so we we're, we're, we're going on your on your word. So yeah, um, crack on. So I'm going to cut the little hat die first um, in a bit of cream card. I have to say, this is not water colour card. It's just a plain cardstock that I've had on my shelf. It is a little bit chalky, so it does tend to grab the colours. So if you used a watercolour card, you would get a different effect. I'm stepping on this Stepping again. on cables again. I know. I'm Born in the plug. Have I done it again? <laughs> no, no, you're good. You're good. <laughs> you hang tight to that plug I know, today. I just, I just watch your feet for the rest of the year. I know. <laughs> My feet are not that oh, she big. She always tap they? dances when she crafts. It's yeah, just yeah, yeah, yeah. it's just a non-stop <laughs> Charleston for the sort of thing going on. Good job I haven't got big feet. Oh, yeah. Goodness knows what I could do. <laughs> okay, so I'm using the distress ink here, and this is vintage photo. And the reason why I'm not using our Nuvo inks is because I want to watercolour with it. So I'm just looking at the edge of the stamp and press my die cut onto it. There is a tiny little bit of manoeuvrage here. So there, you can see it. There's a tiny little line around it, but it is ever so tiny. So, while I've got my my stamping block out, I may as well stamp my little hedgehog. Okay, okay. We're working. I yes. did, Dan can see my face now, I'm just thinking, it's not working. I can't I get just, it. Working. I can see that you're doing stuff on the phone. I'm just trying to you're like find multiple the, things on to the try phone. and to find the connection, yeah. but it's no working. I believe you're there. Oh, and you're on there. and and there as well. Oh, there thank you, everyone. Yeah, yeah. you all there. And you guys. Okay. So there is our little hedgehog. Sorry, Dan. It's okay. It's okay. There we go. You can see him over there. Yeah. He is such a cutie. Good. Very nice. So if the first stamp is seen that sort of style that I think we've we've done a bit like that. Like the fairies were a little bit like that that we did reflections a, a while back, but it's a yeah, different sort of illustrated it is. Cool style. Like um It is. Uh, what's that? The book with the rabbit, Beatrix Potter. Beatrix Potter. Yeah, a bit like Beatrix Potter sort of uh, you know, feel to it. Animals so of Farthing Wood, if anyone remembers anyone remembers that. Yes, I remember yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. It's I quite, do quite a good programme that. So that's all I'm doing is watercolouring over the top. I am not doing these are our it's our fine um aqua pen. So I'm literally just colouring them in. I'm not doing anything special. So if you've got a water pen and you're thinking, I don't know what to do with that, then please don't be afraid to use it. No, oh, I don't need to colour that, but it doesn't matter if I have. It's with this style of colouring, you know, you don't have to be perfect with it. You, you don't. just sort of go you don't. that's the effect, you know, that's the I think with watercolour it's a very loose type of colouring anyway. So I've just going over the little bits of his face. You can add as much or as little to this as you want to. It depends whether 
you want a lot of definition or a little bit. You can add more colours on top. Uh, Sue Stunt says, I told myself I didn't need this kit, but Ali is fast convincing me otherwise. Oh, <laughs> bless you. We had a feeling, of, you know, when cause we were showing you, you know, little sneak peeks and things like that, but we had a you know, feeling that when you guys saw the dyes and the I think, stats, uh, yeah, like dyes by themselves, it's like, it's hard to like, but then you see inspiration and see stuff made with it and it adds that extra element of going like, oh yeah, I could do that with it. Oh yeah, that's I can right. do that. Oh, that's, so it's, it's all part of that then. And yeah. also you'll see what the other girls have done. You know, they are going to do some amazing stuff with their kits as well. I haven't seen them yet, but I know. Yeah. They are going to be amazing. Yeah, a few different styles that, that we've got coming to the you know the party exactly. as well. You've got exactly got some kind of mixed media sort of style, like um, using you know, got a bit of nouveau along with them, and then we've got some cleaner styles if you if you're into that, and you've got some you know yeah, cool you know other styles, just just general you know your paper crafting the UK style that we'd be that we'd be used to as well. So there's That's right. you, you're going to get yeah from different sides as well. Um, if people you know it's working for some people, working for not. Yeah, go, you can go back and forth between YouTube and Facebook. There if you click are. the watch video in the top right, it'll take you to the Facebook uh, hey, uh, YouTube page anyway. So if you ever want to just jump over there, you can do. So I'm really not making a fuss of this. Literally not. I have just put a little bit of ink. I've used a little bit of Aquaflow on there just because I wanted a little bit of a darker brown. And that is him. I have done one that I finished. Oh. Do you have to leave that for very long to dry or just to... No, no, just heat set it, I would. So there's one I'd finished. You can add more colour. As I say, I've probably added a little bit more colour on the other one. Heat set, is that the heat gun? Just a heat, heat gun. Heat gun yeah. Just a heat gun. And there's a little hat there that I've also coloured. And I did that with some of the, the inks that I used in the background. So it just ties everything else in together. But you can practice your colouring, you can cut out... 10 hedgehogs practice your colouring with yeah. you know like everyone yeah. along until you get it perfect. and everyone would be different yeah so you, you can you can get you know used to it and that's the good thing it's not like you know like a colouring book or something like that where you kind of got one shot you exactly. know, like to, to do it with that's the good thing about die cutting you can um, you've got the stamp you you've that. got the die uh, there's quite a few people on youtube so got, uh sarah saying i love peter rabbit uh Inclip saying hello uh say uh, sharon saying thank you to clon on uh, Sarah, come over to YouTube. <laughs> so she's going over to YouTube from Facebook. Yeah, I mean, Katie's, I'm watching on YouTube, so I'm having this there's project. A migration yeah. Uh, <laughs> Kim saying she found us on YouTube. Um, and then she said, uh, Miss uh, Marianne saying, Miss a little pause. I thought it was an owl, maybe. <laughs> maybe I've watched too many Halloween videos. There you go. <laughs> you could, you could make it, maybe. I I mean, really like, the whiskers kind of. No, there they are. Okay, so what I did again then. Because you'd have been watching me cutting and cutting, so I didn't want to do that. I cut the die again in craft card, and I used a little bit of ink over the top. Am my best off here? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Um, I coloured them up with a little bit of ink. They're a little bit dark there, I think. Do you want to do that? Yeah. No, it's all right. And I also cut them in our copper pearlescent. But I wanted, they were looking a little bit flat and I wanted a little bit more out of them. So, what did I bring out? Our mousse. So we've had a few um, comments about mousses going mouldy. So what I would suggest is that you don't put any um, brushes, any um, wet brushes especially, into your pot. Just take a little bit of the mousse out and put it on your mat. And then you're not contaminating anything that's in your pot then. Because you've got the uh, glass mat and also the, is it PD, PFT mat? PF, the 4x14. Yeah, I know. Yes. I can't, I'm trying to think of the name of it as P well. PFT it's it's the roll-up the roll yes. mat that yeah, you yeah, can yeah. use. It's good for like things like water colouring and portable crafting, exactly. I guess. Exactly. <laughs> you know, if you go into a class yeah. or you're going anywhere like that, then that is the perfect thing you want because a glass mat can be a bit heavy. Yeah. Or take a smaller glass mat and a bigger do they do rolling tiny, mat. I know. Do they do tiny glass mats? Have they ever done like a little, like a one, like a, that? We have. No, we haven't do... had a tiny. We've, we've done A4. Uh, A4 is the smallest one we've yeah. done. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Which is quite small. Sorry. I mean, like, if you go A4 card, it's, it's pretty small, really. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah. It has a work surface. 
Yes, it is as a work surface. Yes, yeah. you with your tiny glass. I just thought maybe you get could have, have it on the side. Copyright Owen Roberts, but um, <laughs> uh, like a, th a, you know, a long one on the side, and then you could do. But I guess people just use pallets and things for that, don't they? They do. They do. I mean, you can you can use a poly bag. Yeah, I guess um, you can do that. What do you call them? The, you know, those things you put your files in your files. So that's all I'm going is over the the um, central veins of the leaf with a little bit of embellishment mousse and it really does pick up the sheen I don't know whether you're going to be able to yeah, pick it up nice. is it picking up? Yeah, yeah yeah it looks ever so bright here and I don't always see the same colours you're seeing um, so, so uh, Sylvia's uh, mining gold uh, Sylvia's went mouldy keeps scraping away the mould but it keeps returning I think yeah if you get that bit of bacteria in there or, or anything like that I think if you've the, got the, a mould it will um, come back she's never put water in it uh, you know what I'm like with the mousses <laughs> Sylvia is awesome with, uh, yeah. on, on her mousses like she's she's good yeah. but uh, if, you do, if you do get any issues like that feel free to contact us at support at tonic yeah, studios.com exactly. and we will do our best to help yeah check out any of Sylvia's work as well if you see, if you oh, see and, awesome. and you like some mousses there awesome. some cool <laughs> stuff uh, uh, cool stuff with that so again you know you can see I'm not being faffy with them at all it literally is just a, a little bit of a line you could have been doing these out I know I'm quite I'm, well, I, now we have our now you're like oh no now we have our crafted <laughs> bit like uh, we, Monday mayhem and we, we don't tend to like me and Dan have that sort of thing to, to well, join in. Well, maybe you should yeah. have a, a nouveau challenge. I know then. we should. We'll have a should. No drops for you. No drops. We've got so many. Too bad it is sitting next to that. Uh, yeah. Those drops. There. I bet you're having withdrawals. I am a bit of shakes. There's so many on that shelf to the to the right of Owen there. This I don't think mind. just like because you have an experience like that with. One bad experience with the crystal drop, like I had, was not. Mm. Shouldn't I shouldn't oh, be? I, don't know. I, I shouldn't be banned. Yeah, I, shouldn't be banned. banned. <laughs> I shouldn't be banned from them all together. I think you've had more than one. I'm though. in the stage of bargaining now. Aren't yeah. I? Like, yeah. No, it's not working. Come on, I'll just do only on, one a little bit. Just, just a little bit. bit. Um, so we got a few more people. Um, we got a few more people on YouTube. So we got Kim, uh, Julie. Uh, Inclip saying love that hedgehog yeah so if you do want any other stuff this is the part of the craft kit which is available on uh, toniccraftkit.co.uk uh, and is available for most European countries and uh, America as well uh, and if you do have anywhere outside of those please feel free to contact yeah, us I, and we will try and add it Inclip is a great crafter as well yeah thanks for, for tuning in yeah check out uh, his yeah, channel yeah, it's awesome yeah. oh I, I caught some of them the other <laughs> yeah. night yeah, yeah, my yeah. word really yeah, talented so crafter yeah thanks yeah. you are awesome good. Um, we got just going to check the, the beef in my slow cooker, Christine. <laughs> Keeping us on. Yeah. Finger on the pulse. We, we got, uh, uh, tell us how that beef is, if it's going. <laughs> Love it, Christine. I'm slightly offset in these leaves because I want to see the wreath underneath as well. Oh, but the, uh, Sabine Owl's with us. Um, you got, yeah, seriously, I sometimes use my stamping block for my moose. You, you oh, that one jumped. Yes, you can do. You can use the top as your blending um, platform. Any smooth, you know, smooth surface, I guess, is it? Or you can use a tile. Um, there's so many surfaces. Yeah, kitchen tile would be. Good. Yeah, but I mean, if if you have got a glass mat, then everything is in front of you. You don't need anything else. Did um, uh, do people still use those ones? Do you know, like an art, a stereotype of an artist. You know, holding like the a palette. palette. Yeah, like to use it those tends for like to be more um, oh like oil painters acrylic painters they mm. will they will blend yeah. on there definitely oh what's that man that uses emulsion on the telly or maybe you don't um, Bob Bob Ross. something yeah with Bob a big Ross. emulsion brush Bob Ross <laughs> yeah. so there's our next layer of leaves so really this is a big building up exercise here mm. again next bit so i have our little hedgehog and i got his hat so there's a little bit of a bend in his hat and that's there for a purpose if you put a little bit of a snip into that hat it will sit on his head at a nice little bit of a jaunty angle so a little bit of 3d foam there's our jaunty angle He is cute. Now yeah. we can get a better picture than that. Can we just go a bit closer? Is uh, it because of the light? There we go. We like a bit of jaunt. He doesn't have to have a jaunt though. He can be. 
Oh, it could be down the line. He's it got could business. Be straight on the top yeah. of his business head. Business hedgehog. Now we like a bit of jaunt. <laughs> we do like a bit of jaunt, really. Uh, Christine says, "Yeah, you can use ceramic tile for for mousse." I still says she'll send in. Uh, she'll just, you know, to tag a picture of us done in mousse when the second collection came out. Keep watching your page. Yeah, check her oh, out. Oh yeah. yeah. She said, she just said she sent it. If you're not a member of the group, um, yeah, since I'll send, so maybe not yet. Um, if you're not a member of the Tonic Facebook uh, group, uh, join us. Uh, people just upload it all all the time. So yeah, in clips there, yeah, no worries. Uh, practice makes perfect. Oh, I tell them exactly. Yeah. <laughs> How are you meant to learn in this? You exactly, know? you do have to learn. Yeah, just one crystal drop. I'll I'll do a crystal drop and I'll just practice like you never did thing. a. <laughs> And A, uh, just like. Oh, A! Yeah. So you meant like a, a bit of a like, bottle. And it's, like, it's, a. Like, uh, it's like a karate kid type karate, thing. Karate, yeah. <laughs> you don't need a bottle to truly craft. So there's our little fella sat inside. And the next thing I'm going to do now is to do the copper leaf and the vein, then. Cool. So I've cut the biggest leaf out of um out of a bit of copper card so i'm just going to get rid of all these bits here and i thought we'd have a little day of a bit of nouveau because we haven't yeah we don't we have new, spates of nouveau we have special we? nouveau specials you know often tonic live is the place where we show off the launches what we, we've got coming up and we have got you know we got a launch coming up as well on, on a chanda so yeah we just try and sometimes we do get the chance to go full nouveau and show you exactly. everything exactly I mean, I, I'm trying more to bring it into even our, you know, our normal demonstrations and our cards. If you're wondering what this is, I've lost the label. People come in and pinch the labels in my room. <laughs> so this is actually Why? our medium glue pen. Oh, all right, all right. It's I'm, not, I'm, I'm looking at Rich for that. It's for never anything. Yeah. It's not anything intrigued Special or new. Special formula that you've So got. I'm just stamping straight onto the leaf now. and take it off and leave that to dry for a second okay and then we'll do something with that so our next bit i'm going to do i've got another leaf here for you i cut lots of these leaves here and i have got a brown one we can keep them in a little pot you, you know can. if you want to make extras you, you do and you're doing a few uh, Elaine Shields is with us this afternoon, everyone. Uh, Sylvia says she sent that picture, so we'll, we'll check that. We've got a new show coming Friday, uh, so our brand new, um, it's the Tonic Social Club. And it's Tonic Social Club! And it's going to be, yeah, so, something different. And there is going to be a section for it to be showing off your work as well. So yeah. um, just that, uh, it's just replacing that Tonic Show Tonic in a way which is going to be structured, organised, but it's going to be recorded as well. So you'll be able to, if you can't always join us on a Friday, you'll be able to watch it back later when you're not missing. You know, you're not missing the live interaction. It's going to be all there, but uh, yeah, something to look forward to. That's 4 p.m. Friday. <laughs> We've done some bits for it, so some bits are ready. Yeah. I'm unfortunately not in tomorrow, so it's going to be a lot done <laughs> Friday, Friday morning. morning. But busy. let's see what we can put We're together. We're excited about it. Just it if it. anything, it's just like any other live rushed on our part. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's, it's high concept. Yeah, so far. Um, okay, so on on the one I did earlier, I had it's your big day. So this one we have in birthday wishes. But Sabina saying glue pen or on a clear stamp. Is that what it was? Yeah. It was a glue pen on a clear stamp, and I'll show you what I'm going to do with it now. So this is our clear mark embossing pad and some gold embossing powder. So I'm just going to pop that. Oh, I tell you what, can you shimmy that back in the pot for there for me? Before oh, no, I, before we have a catastrophe yeah. here. I tied it once and now you're just... Yeah. I know, and now I take the <laughs> mickey, all, all don't I? I? <laughs> Sorry, oh. No, it's all right. <laughs> I'm sure he'll find, find a way to... Uh, I'm sure so well, I'll yeah. pay back. Yeah, yeah. There you go. Tell you what, it's a little bit on the hot side. Where's my... Woo! <laughs> I take this away. It's a proper crafters workstation yeah. today. I know when I've made a mess on your floor. Oh no! We are, we are. He's gonna shoot me, baby. <laughs> so there's our birthday wishes. All embossed on our leaves. Embossing powder is so cool. Isn't it? It is I exactly. love give embossing it, powder. Yeah. Give it a bit of a flex. You can't see the gold. So much so. There you go. There you go. So you we love a bit gold. more gold now. There, there, there you can see. Um, 
Sabine tells us, won't it ruin the stamp if you use the glue on there? No, no. Mm -hmm. Just wipe it off the stamp with a baby wipe and that would be good to go again. Thanks for the heads up earlier, Lily, who said I'd left the top off the, the wet wipes. So yes. I, I, I went in, I, I, Dan saw me reading it and I go, good shout, and I just went in and just shut the top. <laughs> I was like, thank you, you just, uh, I went in there and did it. So I, I warned you, didn't I? I said the top one might be dry. Ah, right, oh, that's right. Oh, that's fine. Okay, so these are our gilding flakes. Careful now. Please don't breathe. <laughs> so I'm gonna take This our... is what almost went on the floor earlier. I so know. imagine this. Imagine that all on the floor. <laughs> that, that's settle in for a little bit. Yeah. It's probably about what, f like, close to five times as much as you get in a regular <laughs> pot. I know. And then like There's all of that all in one pot. go on the floor. Okay. The so there's my. I'm gonna put the lid on very Check. gingerly. Put it back in. And the put pot. it to the side. Yeah. Take it away from me. <laughs> <laughs> no, we have. Well, yeah, we have got a section for. So I've. I've got a little bit of a. An inking brush. And then I'm just going to brush off the excess, and that's our gilding on the leaf with Ooh. flakes. So good. good, so good. And it makes it so easy. You haven't got that tack. You know, normally if I use the glues, I've got mess all over my hands. Yeah, I'm a bit of a, a mucky pep. <laughs> So yeah, everything Alison's used dye and stamp by so far has been in the, the craft kit. So um, if you want to go and have a look at that now, it's toniccraftkit.co.uk to purchase the monthly or quarterly subscription as well. There we are. So on plug, this plug, little plug. hedgehog, <laughs> I have cut around his paws and I've slotted the leaf behind them. So you can do that. Or if you're not that way inclined, which not all of us are, you can just put the leaf on top. If you've got any of the buildables bits, you can use the accessories you and could. stuff and, and you connect could. them up with that. So you, know, you can. Um, do there's a little party hat in there. Yeah. That would that would look perfect with these. Balloon. Balloon. Dimple. Yes. Um, Moss Croc has got the party hat, doesn't yeah. he? So on the top of this, I'm right over the top where I've stamped. That's where I'm popping my leaf. So. You can see exactly. So he's just popping his head over the top of the leaf. It's so cute. It <laughs> is cute. Good shine, yeah. good shine it to is it. Cute. That's what I, I like. Um, I they said that? one off. Um, the, the one offs are gone. The, the one offs haven't gone yet. Um, they, they haven't been launched yet. So if, if you're looking, if you you like the look of the kit, but you you know you want to just buy the one off. You don't want to subscribe necessarily yet. Even though if you do subscribe, you can cancel any time. Then Monday, uh, what we've got left is going to be a, like made available uh, yeah. for, for a one-off purchase. So um, if you are waiting, you don't want to wait for that. You haven't got to wait too long. You know, um, Monday you'll be able to get involved in this and and uh, and, and do that. But if you do want to subscribe and, and be, get part of it, yeah. you know, we're going to be releasing these every month. Then then get on that website and and and, uh, and take part. Um, what have I got? Because I got with the with the monthly subscription and the quarterly subscription, there are extra benefits. So, uh, monthly subscription, uh, the postage is wavered, so you don't have to pay the postage every time, as well as getting an extra free gift in the pack. Uh, with the quarterly, you're saving yourself five pounds on each box plus no postage then as well. So uh, oh. that is in one go then, and also free boxes every uh, free gifts every time. Free, yeah, uh, free really tonic. Well, we consider it dub tonic merch almost. Tonic so merch. if you are. Uh, yeah, if you, you, know, you like the sound of that, then get involved. Um, a few people ask about the blender brushes, and we always, whenever that they come out, uh, we get asked about these. Um, yeah. Have you had a US release? They, they have been released, they, yeah. They, they have been yeah. released, yes. yeah. Um, I have, have to check on those and, and find out, because maybe they're them, just not out in the trade much. I don't know. They put them on the website earlier. <laughs> 975N, I'm thinking. I don't know. Maybe it's a go memory, maybe it's Google so that and then see what Yeah, happens. 97N tonic and, <laughs> yeah. and you'll find it. But that's the way to find any product. If you find a code you you need, if you Google it, um, you'll often find uh, traders and retailers who've got those products out there. Okay, so I've overlapped the two little stamps, uh, little dies. I put the brown one behind. And then I'm just going to decorate the rest of it. So I've got a little bit of ribbon that I've just tied into a knot. So these can be, you know, you've got little scraps at the end of your, well, maybe you haven't, but <laughs> I'm sure you've got, got loads scraps. of scraps Scraps everywhere. at the end of the roll, or you've tied a bow when you've got ends yeah. that you think, oh, they're a little bit long, I don't want to chuck them in the bin. 
then these are the times to use them um, I didn't want to make it a very girly girly card I wanted it to be that you could give it to any sex because I didn't think I think this would suit a man I as well yeah, yeah even though he's got a flower in his hat <laughs> I didn't think it was overtly female no so hopefully is it a certain like properly to ribbon that you know if you had like an old shirt or an old blouse like in the ladies case that you yeah. could sort of just cut you know, a strip and just use it as yeah. as that yeah there's not like so you know so if you cut an edge just like that you're all right and yeah. you, you can just do that so if you've got old stuff you can do it um nice with frayed edges yeah so this yeah. is just a little bit of a an old wooden button and i didn't particularly like the colored side so it's the back of it that i've used um i should have another bow somewhere Maybe I have. Also, um, Joan's asking you: Are there plenty of kits left? And what to cut off take toward them? So, um, about half half have gone so far. There's, you know, there, there will be kits up. You know, I, I believe for, for for Monday. So, um, so th there'll be some there. We'll let you know once they're all gone or they're approaching near the end. We'll yeah. let you know so so that you're not, yeah. you know, you will we'll get, we'll give you a chance. But it'll be the thirty first. It'll be if yeah. the last time that you can order up until that point because that's when we're packing them up and going. Then you won't be able to buy this kit. You know, they, these thighs and stands. You won't be able to get them again. Because we're not, you know, they're not going to be yeah, sold on a channel. No. They're not going to be sold through through the trade. So, yeah, you know, if you are into, you know, in this kit before the thirty first, but you've got some time before then, you know, it's not providing this still stock to, to take a look and uh, and and to decide whether you whether you want them. But yeah, they're great. Uh, I just love, you know, it speaks for itself. <laughs> the, the tutorial, you know, I don't need to say and, much um, more. Yeah. So you're not only getting the die and stamps that Alison's using today. You're also getting a collection of Nouveau items as well as Craft Perfect items, which will be revealed later. Yeah. So I've done his tiny little eyes as well. If you don't make them too big, then they look quite cute. If you <laughs> make them, t you know, bigger than that, then they look a bit scary because <laughs> they kind of overpower what his face. What are you doing, red? Red. Then it's that Halloween. Then. Yeah, yeah. It's Halloween, and it Halloween could be a Halloween hair job. Yeah, <laughs> like it. Because it's a little bit um, steampunky, I think it that is. hat is. It is. I think it is. Yeah. So if you're into your steampunk, then again, I think this could be perfect. Uh, yeah. So there's our card, all finished, with our drops on, and I'm not going to hold it up for too long. You don't now. hold this one. They, yeah. they can, <laughs> this is the. <laughs> this is, and it's. It's this kind one. of near us today. Yeah, it's so surprisingly <laughs> yeah. good. It's good. Yeah, a bit of a run here, Al. Yeah. I know, I've done two things now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yeah so, so, I hope you like it, and I yeah. hope you're going to be um, interested in our kit and join us with yeah. it. Yeah. Because there's more to come. Yeah, exactly. And uh, like Owen said a few times now, basically, that die and stamp set, so the die, the hamsters, and the wreath and things, once this kit goes, they will never be available again. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. Were, were there some th some things on YouTube that, that oh, we sorry. missed? I don't know what, what I did. So. Oh, guys, like flowers. I think no, it's Karen. Uh, I've looked forward to my extra gift. I think some people saying subscribing. Yeah, the gift I've been I've been working on, ringing around. <laughs> and, and, and <laughs> to be fair, Owen has tried weirdly hard to. It's, it shouldn't be this hard to get what he's after, but nonetheless, no, I, 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 like, it, <laughs> I want to get it just right though, and, and yeah. I, th I think I have. Um, I always uh, cut off the hanger strips uh, of the shoulders and use them for crafting. That's a good, that's a good idea. Um, I really like this card. It's absolutely for anyone. A nice autumn theme. Yes. Yeah, Billy. Um, and gorgeous Ali. Lovely, uh, beautiful card from Clonamon as well. Thank you. Oh, everyone. thank you very much. And thanks much. for sticking around with us when the internet yes, was, was not you. so good today. Um, <laughs> thank you. But uh, yeah, that's it from, from us today. We've got back now on Friday for the first uh, Tonic Social Club, Tonic uh, Social which Club. Um, so you, that's 4 p.m. and uh, you'll just be able to watch it. It'll be a recorded show, which will be uploaded around that time. Yeah. So you, you'll be able to catch up and, and enjoy that, and it'll feature all Loads your favourite Ali stuff. moments, <laughs> the craft clinic, and, and some other um, some other special bits. So yeah, all, all that to come. Thank you, everyone. If you're interested in this, you go on um, uh, the link that uh, that Dan will put in there. What's Tonic, that thing again? Toniccraftkit.co.uk. There you go. Um, it's a very difficult link. So I think, yeah, uh, so you, you can go on there and uh, and find out more. There's plenty there, but yeah, thanks everyone for joining us, and we'll see you soon. Okay. Yes, see you soon.